Dex Tech Pro. So folks, this is Dex and you're watching Dex Tech Pro. In this video, I'm going to be teaching you the new app called PS4 Items Flow, which is great tool and also tweaks up the appearance of your PlayStation 4 user interface in a cool way. First off, you want to download it from the link below and transfer it to your USB stick or hard drive which is formatted with either FAT32 or XFAT. Then plug it back to PS4's USB port to install. Make sure PS4 is jailbroken first. If you're new to my channel, you better watch this video to learn how to fully jailbreak your PlayStation 4 console first. Not only this, but you can also go to the playlist in my channel and click on PlayStation 4 tutorials to watch, learn and expand the knowledge of your jailbreaking by watching those videos if you wish so. Alright, let's go to Gold Hand Menu, Debug Settings, Package Installer and Install Items Flow Application. There it is. Open it up. It asks to download covers for installed games which I don't want it. And this is it. As you can see guys, it gives you a brand new look with all installed games on my console with different look. Press options button on DualShock controller to get into settings. Then press R1 to expand settings into advanced options. Let me explain some of the handy tools here. For example, set as default dashboard makes this application default dashboard instead of the traditional one. You can turn it on or off by hitting on cross button on controller. With PKG installer, you can install PKG files from internal or external hard drives on PlayStation 4. Rebuild FPKG database helps you to recover your installed games list. Get loaded and come back again if it happens that PS4 doesn't let you see and run them while the games are existed on your console. If you're a little bit confused, I'm gonna clarify it by putting it in this way that it's very possible that sometimes kernel panic occurs, which makes your console lose only the list of the games, not the games themselves, on the PS4 dashboard that you can see them to play. If you're not familiar with jailbreaking terms or jargons, you need to just watch this video tutorial called Top 20 PlayStation 4 Jailbreaking Frequently Asked Questions Answered by Me to expand your knowledge over jailbreaking terms, conditions, and jargons. Okay, next one is Console Power Control which takes you to the power option as it is obvious from the name. You can reset changes you made in this application back to the default by this option for sure. Turn off startup cover message helps you to eliminate the question asking you if you wish to download the game's covers or not when you run up this application first. You can also sort installed games and apps by random, alphabet title name or alphabet application name here. Theme installer helps you install themes from internal or external hard drive if you have any. Open PS4 menu takes you directly to the settings, then you have access to features and options, or takes you to the features available in the rest mode as well. You can switch these options with D-pad back and forth by the way. Font installation will be applicable from this here if you have any. Reflections could be activated and deactivated from this one as you can see here, but I believe that activated one is way better. Still, it is your choice and that's the end of this video tutorial. Thank you for watching and have a good one. Subscribe to Dextech Pro YouTube channel. Channel.